Hi, today we are heading straight into space. First, we'll create a composition with dimensions 1080, 1080 and a duration of 4 seconds. Using the pen tool, we'll draw our very first short line. Then, we go to the layer parameters, find our freshly baked line and Ctrl D, duplicate it. We position them where we want and if needed, shorten them. Press P on the keyboard to open the position parameter and paste in the magic expression. Yes, you'll find it in the video description. Or on my Patronite where I've got more goodies waiting for you. And here's the magic. Once you duplicate a line, it automatically positions itself exactly where it needs to be. No tedious manual shifting. You can duplicate it endlessly, well, at least until your patience runs out. Then I play around with the lengths, some longer, some shorter. When the layout is ready, we center it neatly using the Align panel. On the first line, we add the Trim Paths effect. Find it in the parameters by selecting Add. Open the End parameter and set it to about 90%. Now, in Offset, type this simple expression. Time, Shafters, 90. This makes the animation loop perfectly. Since we have 4 seconds, we divide 360 degrees by 4. Copy the effect to all lines and we have movement. Now we create a new composition. This will be our main scene. From the project panel, we drop in the composition we made with the lines. We apply the CC sphere effect and suddenly, flat lines turn into a glowing sphere. In rotation, I set the sphere's position. In render, I select outside. And in the light tab, I set the first parameter to zero. I also want to add a sphere that looks like Earth. I've already downloaded a planet map from Freepik, so I bring it in as a new composition. It also gets the CC sphere effect and is placed beneath the lines. I reduce its radius to around 150. And match the position to be exactly the same as in the line layer. On Earth, I create an animation in rotation Y. So it spins in the opposite direction of the lines. On the line layer, I add the deep glow effect to give it a beautiful glow. And here's a little trick. Inside the line composition, Offset some of the lines randomly, so they look more natural. Done! We now have a beautiful animation of an orbit with a rotating Earth. If you liked it, you know what to do. Subscribe, like and comment. Let's help this animation orbit around YouTube, just like our lines around the sphere.